and as promised, we have returned. But we have some unfinished business here tonight. The CMDL has returned and it is back for the finals, baby. K rule throws out the opening pitch. These were the two best teams by the time the regular season ended. Player lockout shortened season. This K rule starts out the game strong with a strikeout. Luigi next up to bat. Keep in mind, items are on here. K. Rool already has an item. Luigi barely gets contact there. Oh, and he strikes out. Mario up to the plate. And this team, it can hit. Question is, you know, it's been a while since they've played, and Mario grounds out there. It's Yoshi's up for the Yoshi eggs, and... You know, both these teams bringing out new looks after the lockout shortened season. Mario starting off, obviously, at the mound. And Pink Yoshi makes the quick pitch to first. Baby Peach batting second. And that's another ground out. Two outs here for their third baseman and right fielder, sorry. Toadsworth, not necessarily known for his power hitting, but that is, oh my goodness, the item too. And Toadsworth with the first base hit of this game. Toadette up to the plate, and this team's a speedy team. Built directly by Finn Daly, who's known for more of his power lineups. They can hit with the critters, but they're later down in the lineup. It's up come the Piantas. Top of the second, we're going to have a scoreless game here. I think we might be looking at a pitcher's duel. Yellow Pianta looks to crack this game wide open. He's swinging for the fences here. That's high and deep. Toadsworth gets under it. He's hit with the fireball, but too late. He makes the grab. Noki at the plate. Change up from Critter. Through the glove of Critter and Noki's on first. That's the first base hit tonight for the Mario Fireballs. Blue Pianta up. Blue Pianta trying to steal there and showing off the speed. The Blue Pianta, man, he can run for days. As he steals second. That's a heck of a play by Pianta right there. That's high up. Pianta not tagging back up to second. Interesting decision there. I don't know real, what Pianta was doing there, really, but... You know, Pianta was in scoring... Or, excuse me, Noki was in scoring position there. It's Blue Toad up to the plate. Caught by Noki at center field. Blue Toad at second now. Critter blasted! What a catch by Blue Yoshi! No double play. And this is just what the value the Yoshis bring to each roster. Being able to make that extended grab with the tongue. Great versatility and great defense there. This green critter clobbers that. Noki hustling and she'll get it. King K rule and we know he can hit. Mario going to try to pitch around him and even then... That's a standing, that's a standing base hit. RBI chance for Red Critter now. Mario, the meatball. Throws it to home. They tag up. And a lot of hits, but no runs. Neither team be able to capitalize here. Green Noki up to the plate. Slap it right down the line. That's exactly what they need. Green Noki with the base hit. Pink Yoshi up to the plate. Now this is a pretty weak part of their lineup in terms of strength. You can tell these Nokis. The Mario Fireballs, they want the Nokis to run. And a 
again, Yoshi just not able to get good contact today. Oh, that's a that's a heck of a play by Critter. That's an incredible double play. And we talked about versatility on defense. Look at this. Critter stretching out, making that diving grab and throwing it quickly to first. That's exactly what you want out of the second baseman. Anybody who can just play that middle of the field, nobody does it better than the Critters. Speaking of that diving again, Green Critter refused to be up as uh, K. Rule shows signs of frustration at the mound. Top of the line up here, and coming to the bottom of the third. Yoshi batting lead off. So that will be foul tip. Two strikes. So that's in the glove of Blue Yoshi. A baby peach. Mario said beforehand, quote, we're not afraid of no baby peach. Now that is crazy to say about your opponent, but there's a one, two, three inning. And before you know it, here we are, top of the Rav 4th inning. Blue Yoshi, Luigi, and Mario. All up to the plate. And we know Blue Yoshi, if he can get on base, he's a real problem for the defense. He's able to use his leg just to make a play, but what a grab by Brown Critter. And again, k showing signs of frustration at the mound. And Luigi... with an earthquake of some sort. Tornado, excuse me. He gets on base. Mario, he's an offensive weapon. Luigi getting a bit overzealous there with the base running. This Mario Firewalls team has been aggressive from the jump. As Yoshi just freezes there. That's one of the best that's one of the best fielders in the league right there, just giving up on the play. Luigi could have gone home, but instead opts to play it safe. Speak of the devil, Yoshi coming into the game for Yellow Pianta. And that is right down the gap. Yellow Pianta with quite a hit. Mario going to retreat back to third. And that's a great RBI from Yellow Pianta, able to make good contact and keep his team ahead of the game. Blue Noki up now. And again, immediately using the boo. What a throw by K. Roll in the outfield, but I mean, there's just a great hit there. Right where the shortstop can't get it, turns the ball invisible with the help of Blue Pianta. That's just a peck of a play right there. Yoshi starting to recognize. Maybe he's pitching a bit too slow. And that's a double play. Toadsworth out in that right field position. He's been having a good having himself a good day today. As we head in the bottom of the fourth, Toadsworth up to bat. Blue Toad on deck. Again, these weaker hitters. Mario is just challenging them, begging them to hit it downfield, and we know Blue Toad is going to accept that challenge every day of the week. He can hit, and he does! That's deep! And it's into the glove of Blue Noki at the wall. Brown Critter. Now this is the part of the lineup where if you're Mario, you have to start worrying. Is that's cracked by a brown critter. And that's foul. And an interesting decision there by Pink Yoshi using a bit out of his reach there. Had to use the star grab. Interesting choice. Is that's high and deep and no. That will be foul for Green Critter. And, oh my goodness, what a misplay by Baby Luigi. Bases are loaded for King K. Rule. And if I'm Mario, I'm just going to pitch around him. K. Rule is not someone to be messed with. Star hit 
from the king of the crocodiles. Caught! Oh, what a grab! What a grab by Pianta and the throw! And Noki showing off the speed there. What a sequence by the fireballs. And I don't think I've seen a team turn a situation like that into a better one. But here we are, top of the fifth. Green Noki up to bat. Uses the star hit. And oh my goodness, Baby Peach just freezing out there in the outfield. Noki. Noki's trying to head home. Going to stay back, stay at third. Almost had a little league home run, but that is a great hit. Yoshi showing bunt. And that will be foul. Oh, is that fair? Ah, uh, it's foul. If that was fair, that would have been a nightmare for the Mario Fireballs. It's Yoshi trying to test Critter there. Oh, he will not. And in goes Green Noki. And again, this Mario Fireballs team showing off that speed kills baby Luigi to the plate. Yoshi getting a bit overzealous there. And Yoshi barely steals that base. Oh! That's a double play! I don't think I've ever seen anything like that. And the momentum is completely shifted in favor of the Yoshi eggs. The blue Yoshi gets on base here. He has an opportunity to keep his team alive. And blue Yoshi showing off the wheels there. Center, the catcher, I'm sorry. That's got to be painful. Again, shortstop Critter showing off his ability to go for the ball even in tough situations. And right there, it pays dividends. As we head into potentially the final inning of the first season of CMBL. Red Critter up to bat. You can tell he wants to send this one to the fences. He wants to give his team a chance. And that's exactly what he'll do! Red Critter! Almost out of the park there! And Mario showing that he's tired. Looks like the, def the team's gonna have a meeting at the mound. They don't necessarily have an elite pitcher. So it looks like Luigi's coming in. Luigi, he's got nasty curve. Oh, what a... Whoa, that, that might be a penalty. Can Noki get it there in time? She can't. And this infield chemistry is just great now with Luigi at the mound. And that's a double play, and that's the season! The Mario Fireballs! are your Season 1 CMBL champions. And your MVP of the night, Yellow Pianta, co-MVPs, excuse me, Blue Noki and Yellow Pianta. 3-1 is your score. Here's the voting. And here's the voting for the Yoshi Eggs. And I mean, that has to be a disappointing ending of the season. Obviously not the ending you wanted, but, you know, the Yoshi Eggs showed up and... You know, come this time, next season, I think I can see them back in the finals. But until then, we have to see the redraft. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been my honor and privilege being able to present to you the first season of the CMBL. It truly has. I know there's been tough times. I know I haven't been uploading a lot, but I promise, season two of CMBL is going to be a lot better. I can't say much right now. But I'll see you around. Later, broskies.